Hello and welcome to today's live stream of Strawberries and Video Games. As you can see in the title, um, I think I posted it in my schedule as well, for today's Sunday live stream, I'm going to be trying out a game that just launched on PC, and I think the Switch as well, called Life Slide. Um, it's interesting, I'm playing on PC today. I don't have the audio yet, I will enable that in a minute seems that when I click over to OBS, the game audio just kind of pauses for a minute. But this is the start screen. I have literally not checked out a single thing. I just installed it and got this far. Um, so this is completely brand new to me. Life Slide, however, I think originally came out in 2019 to Apple Arcade. So the game itself isn't completely new. It's just new to PC, so you can get it through Steam, and it's new to the Switch. So this just launched for those platforms on Friday. So yeah. Um, it's also an indie game, by the way, and it just, it looked really appealing. It looks like a fun flying game, maybe not quite as complicated as Flight Simulator, which is another flying game I was recently checking out. I didn't stream that one, I've just been playing that one on my own. Cool, but very complex. Um, anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and click over here and get the audio going. Here we go. Um, oops, sorry. Now I'm changing it on my computer. See, this is the weird thing. If I want to turn it down on OBS, then it pauses. Let's try this. Okay, I think that should be good. Um, but as always, if the game is too loud or I'm too loud, if levels are off and you're in the chat, always can drop me a note and let me know and uh, I can get that fixed. But anyway. I also, so I have this on PC, but I have my my new Strawberry controller hooked up to the PC, so I'm trying to play via controller. Um, I don't know how that's going to work. I haven't, like I said, haven't tried any of this yet, um, so I don't even know what the controls are. Anyways, though, so we have story mode, zen mode, and compete. I'm just, looks like story, or story mode, looks like zen mode's even grayed out. I wonder if you have to earn it or something. Um, I'm just gonna... There's an achievement that's cut off in the corner there. That's weird. Um, <laughs> just do story. I'm also gonna... Hold on. Fix my background. And knock things over in the process. Hm. Oh, I can move. Okay, we'll fix the background in a minute. Can I pause it? I can. Okay. <laughs> I'm just trying to... I don't know why the background is so iffy today. One moment. Use a different light. There we go. <laughs> My ring light has different settings, and apparently some don't work with the uh, chroma key very nicely. Okay, let's get to it. Okay, so it's an inverse. So down is up and up is down. Interesting. The music is making me think of Tetris. Oops. Missed. Oh, I get an extra little light each time. It's so peaceful. Oh, where are we flying to? I'm dropping. Why am I flying so low? What's happening? Oh, pull up, pull up. Why am I flying so low? Eek. Why am I dipping? Breathing? Who's breathing? 
stay, stay in place. Stay close and parallel to the ground for a good flight. Okay. Use the terrain beneath to your advantage and don't be afraid to dive down. Okay. So, whoa, whoa, okay. Well, I tried to fearlessly dive down and then it just hit the bottom. So does that help me get speed? So cool, it's like everything is made of paper, but it also is reminding me of like slopes of a mountain. Oh. Okay, the ground definitely seems to be helping me pick up speed. This is interesting. What's that? I hope I can fly into that. Plane, ooh! Oh, you can earn different paper planes! That's pretty. Wait, what's counting? Conscious. Why am I? Oh. Time. Your integrity decreases over time. And also when colliding, collect time and restore it and stay in flight. Interesting. Whoa. Whoopsies. I guess maybe just by going up and down. Like diving has me pick up speed. Some of this is also starting to remind me of Spyro, my favorite video game ever. Um, just like the series in general. At least the, the first three were amazing. <laughs> but I remember these flight modes. Um, and now what do I do? Mindful. Breathing, conscious, mindful. This is interesting. So do these things give me time? Oh yeah, these are time things. They're just in a different color. This is matter. Use it- oh, use it to purchase improvements and appearances in between flights. Okay. Um, this is kind of making me think of those flight levels in Spyro, though, because he was just a baby dragon, so he normally couldn't fly. And they'd have these levels where temporarily you could fly and you had a timer just like this. Um, and you had to collect so many things and- oh, oh, no! Done. Halt. <laughs> Um, I got to Mindful, that's really interesting. Um, but yeah, I had to collect so many things and defeat so many bad guys. Interesting. Okay. I got to Mindful. 51 is my score, I guess. I don't know what that means. My cursor's in the middle there. Improve? Um... Oh, I can spend- okay, the blue things, the 51, that was the mindful points, and now I can spend them. Um... I, I don't know what yaw and pitch speed is, but if it helps me control the plane better, then yeah. How do I... Oh, I get it, those are like the prices, so I have to get at least 150 to like, increase these. 
and I need 200 if I want to get luck. Alright. Plane. I have a new plane. So this one has better speed and steering, but less lift and integrity. I'm gonna be lame and just stick to the original plane. <laughs> uh, options? No, that's fine. Give up. No, I don't want to give up. I want to retry. Oh, cool! It didn't put me back at the beginning either. It just uh, put me at the back beginning of Mindful. Okay. Oh, now we got different ones. It's like, okay, do I want coin? Or do I want time? I need some time. So chill. And this is story mode, so what is Zen mode then? Is it just like free fly and there's no objectives maybe? Whoops, 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 whoops. I have cookies today. both at once. Awesome! Okay, let me prioritize the time one, so... Gives you a strong boost forward. Okay. Uh, can I use it somehow? Oh, I just pressed A. This is not easy, first of all. Um, hmm. But, okay. Well, now I have money to spend. Um, I could go for luck, increase gems, power ups, and playing parts. Um,. Time reduced time penalty. You know what? I'm I don't know. Let's try lift. Y yeah, I'm sure. I think. <laughs> oh, okay. So those little sections underneath that shows me um how many upgrades I will ultimately get. Okay. Also, there was a little tip I noticed that said if you're having trouble, just try switching planes. Um, so let's also try this plane and see if I suck less. 
Oh wait, there's another checkpoint I got in there. So I'm assuming the last couple I did with like breathing and conscious, those were levels maybe? Whoa. Um. But there's... Oh gosh, I only have 20. Get me to some yellow. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. 15. You know what, skip the green. Go for the yellow. I just need time. And this is bad. <laughs> I don't like that plane. I feel like that was not... Let's do this one. Yes, now what am I... Okay, play. Oh, they gave me a boost off the bat. Is that because I'm play playing so badly? I do like the fact that there's definitely some difficulty. I don't know if I just have a learning curve or what. Whoops. I just missed all those. Okay, I bounced. It's fine. It's fine. I just bounced. I didn't land. Anything, I kind of feel like the next upgrade I want to do is lock because I just want more of the stuff. More chances to collect boosts and things. Okay, I can make it. I can make it. Whoa. I think that's the finish line. That's where the gold things are, right? Right. Or a checkpoint, maybe? Ooh. This is cute. What's this do? Knowledge. Knowledge lets you interact with objects. Use it when the object glows in yellow. I gotta press A. I don't know if I fully understand that, but okay. Oh! Press A and it opened the door with the yellow symbol on it. I'm just noticing the world. <laughs> I was just so focused on collecting things. I'm like, wait, this little garden world is adorable. Whoa. Now I'm getting distracted by my surroundings. Understanding. Wow, I got a lot of, um, mind? Minds? <laughs> what are the blue things? Um, definitely getting some luck. Yes. Definitely finishing my cookie. Hmm. Hmm. 
No, that's interesting. You can already see the stats of the planes that you can earn. That one looks awesome. Oh, okay. I didn't do anything. I messed up. Um. Okay, just double checking. I mean, I like the difficulty, but I don't think I can change it. Not the easiest. Now. That's weird. This time I feel like it actually started me at the beginning, but before that I don't feel like it did. Oh, wait, maybe it's just a different angle. I was looking at it, because there's different paths for this one. It's kind of confusing to know where it's setting me back. I wonder if I quit out, where does it put me back? Like if I wanted to check out compete or zen mode, how much of this does it save? the achievements are cut off. That's not like I set it up wrong on the OBS. It's like on the game screen it's cut off. Oh gosh. This is dangerous. No! Oh, I like destroyed it. Um... like equally leveling things up I feel like uh yeah okay definitely got some midway checkpoint this time to maintain the speed flow thing really well. 
Oh no, I did not get the uh... Okay, let's get this. And open and go straight for time. Oh my gosh. Set about this being super chill because now I feel a little bit more like because I died so many times on this level, like I need to focus. Shit. <laughs> ah! Oh man. Oh, look at the little boats. Oh no. I don't see anything. How come there's not? We're not gonna make it? Okay, I did. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh no. Oh no. Can I recover? I don't think so. How come there's nothing- oh my gosh, it's all the way down there. There's like a huge stretch where just nothing appears. Wait. Oh, now it killed me. Questioning. questioning why there was that long stretch and there was just like nothing glowing um ooh, i have lots of things let's increase the luck i would like more gems and things on the path now please um okay yes okay for real where is the stuff I know, 10 seconds, but why? I have to make it all the way to there? Hmm. Yeah. Let me try one more time and then let me try restarting the chapter, because that's like a really long stretch that I have to go for. I think that's intentional, but this is difficult. Like, how am I supposed to reach the, the time thingies? That's too far away. Oh, wait. Oh, I got it. Jeez. Is this intentional? The really low time and to go up for the green thing that was not mm -mm, not good ah uh, put me back in the beginning that far. 
me. Come on. Bounce, bounce. Damn it. <laughs> if you get stuck, try using a different plane. I don't know if I would trust the other plane. Stuff. I just want the time. <laughs> lots and lots of time, please. Okay, maybe a key. That sounds good. What do I interact with, though? Oh, this is dangerous. What does that do? just knocked off two seconds for hitting the bottom. Um, I might try switching planes. Nope, this is bad. Poop. Um, hold on, let me see. Because the other one gave me more speed. Just less lift and integrity. Okay, let's try it. Maybe that's the other catch, is I really, really need to use this plane. Because of the increased speed on it. Difficult, sheesh. <sighs> oh, I messed up. I missed I missed it. Damn it. Alright. I do not want to give up. I don't like this, just give up. I just quit back out. Try one more time. Oh, one of the developers! Hi! <laughs> this game has some challenges, but I like it. And I, I've never played this before. I didn't play it on Apple Arcade. You know what? If I just... Okay, if I can get a little bit... Oh, 49. Maybe I can buy something else. It's like riding a bike. It takes some time to click with it. Yeah, I can definitely see that. I like the flow of it, though. And these worlds are super cute, by the way. And the music is really fun, too. So I'm failing a lot, but I'm having fun. <laughs> I 
good, but let me see if I can get some items. Ooh. Wait. Nope. Ah. Oh. Um. Yeah, let's... Wait, can I buy any of this? Uh, maybe I'll hold out on the steering. I want more speed. <laughs> like 20 tries but I seem to have a good start on this one now. Now if I just try to fly really, really efficiently and stay close to the ground... So I think I might have been accidentally losing speed before, too. There we go. not good. I messed up! Hold on. What can I... Okay, now I can buy more speed, though. Oh, I can try restarting the chapter and going only for time if it's too difficult. Okay, good to know. I didn't figure that out yet. Let me try buying speed. Let me retry with the the extra speed, like once or twice more. time. Ooh, let me get the plane part too. Yeah. Oh, 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 what's, what's happening? What am I doing? I'm messing up. <laughs> um... Good. 
boost. Looks like I could use one of those. Alright, there we go. Don't hit the ground. I do like the flying feeling that I'm getting from this too, this is pretty cool. Okay. Oh no. Oh, I want the plane part more than I want to activate that. I hope I don't regret this. Rock. Oh no, 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 no! Man. <laughs> um, wait, what can I buy next? You know what? Oh, I'm a little short on integrity. I do want that one next. Oh, did I really go all the way back to the beginning? I felt like I was having such a good run on that one. a ways away. This might not end well. I got it, I got it, I got- nope. I don't got it. <laughs> I was close to the checkpoint too? Oh man. <laughs> I'm feeling persistent today. Um, I might die a hundred times, but I, I don't want to give up. can get integrity now. Yes. I have 20 seconds in the beginning. Okay. I feel like that was a good purchase. We will see. Let's get that key for now and just get time. Ten meters away? Oh my gosh. Oh. See, when you tell me I'm that close, then I, I can't quit. I have to... I can do this. <laughs> I 
Uh, I don't think I can. Okay, one thing I'm figuring out is I probably don't want to, like, do super drastic turns. Oh, this is bad. If I hit that, no. I should have gone for time. Oh, shoot. <sighs> Drastic turns are detrimental to the momentum, especially in the beginning. Okay. Because I feel like when I suddenly panic and try to veer, I just kind of lose speed and it's not good. I have to stay calm. Gone through the middle. Oh. Alright, I'm also finding that some. Oh, really? A lot of people tend to freak out and go up and down a lot. Well, I don't know if it helps that I was playing Flight Simulator, which, like, you cannot make any jerky movements in that for sure. I also like the fact that as challenged as I am on this level now, this is not level one. <laughs> I felt like the beginning was, that was really nice and chill and, and then it definitely ramped up. Double key, what would happen? Let's see. Oh, okay, so it's one. Oh, I used it too early as well. Okay. Oh, now I don't see. Uh... Oh, wait. <gasps> I see. I see the checkpoint. I see it. Oh, that feels so good to get past that one. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I love these slides. What's that do? Alright, use leap to jump over pits and reach higher grounds. Okay. Whoa! Okay, that's fun. I really like this leap thing. Ooh. Um, 
we go. Ooh, that maybe wasn't the smartest move. <laughs> I just really wanted another leap thing. So it would also just generally give me a boost. Like if I just... Yeah, I feel like that helps give me speed too. Ooh. Probably use some more time. Wait, I have a... I didn't realize. I had a jump thing. Oh, where's the time? Oh, I should have gone left. Oops. Okay. Okay, that was not a bad run, though, for that one. And I have a ton of... Uh... Blue stuff to spend. Let's see. Um... Okay, you know what? I haven't used steering yet. Let me get one of those. And then... I could get lift. Let me save that. I also just realized there's a max time that I can have, so I can't go over 57 seconds, it looks like. Alright, so maybe I should <laughs> prioritize getting other things. use it yet, I'm saving it. <laughs> oh, that's a plane part. Can I, I can't really get out of this easily. Oh, I'm gonna miss the plane part. Now I'm starting to run low on time. Oh, but that's the end. Oh, are those... Oh my gosh, I'm in Fruitland! <gasps> Experiencing. Oh, I'm gonna die. I think this is not gonna go well. Oops. Okay, very slow. This is bad. Oh no! I know, right? This is called strawberries in video games, and I just ended up in Fruitland with strawberries everywhere. <laughs> this is where you belong, yes. <laughs> um, 
Okay, I'm gonna save up for that luck one. I'm so close to 500 there. So let's retry it. Okay, there we go. Anytime soon. See some up ahead. This is cool! Oh, there's honeycombs! Wait. <gasps> That's really cute. Okay, I think I'm also noticing if I already picked up like a special item and then I pick up another one, it trades in the original for money. Take me through all sorts of fruit. Oh, that was fun. and I'm kind of flowing. I was really stuck on that one level, that questioning. <laughs> I think it's questioning. I'd be questioning my skills. <laughs> now I have a, a flow. I like this. Freezing. Oh, avalanche. Okay, wait, now I think I can buy... yes. Okay. Um, 290, is there anything else? There's a couple other ones I could get. Let me... let me also increase the lift. And then let's retry from the beginning of freezing. Okay, I also just noticed you can still see some of the fruit as you're going into freezing, so it blends. That's really cute as well. Ooh, okay. Just gonna go for time. The avalanche. Not let me.
my gosh, I see lava. There's a volcano over there. Does that mean I'm close to the next level? Because it looks like it's changing. Ooh! Yearning. So I think the heat- yeah, the heat's like lifting me up. Oh my gosh, there's like... It's like tropical island and volcanoes and stuff now. Ooh! If I fly, yeah. Okay, if I fly over the, the lava, it's gonna lift me up. Uh oh. Oh! I just burned up. Oh no. <laughs> we made all the levels blend like that. Okay. Also, something that changes the atmosphere more abruptly. Interesting. Holy heck, this game is pretty, yes. Um, so just a side note right now, uh, in case you missed in the beginning of the, st the stream, I got this off of Steam. It just launched on Friday. It's an indie game. I think it's also available on Nintendo Switch. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. One of the, the developers is in the chat, which is super awesome. Um, so if you are interested, like I said, I got it off Steam. It was $14.99, by the way. Just launched. Um... Let's see, I'm, oh my gosh, I'm one short of getting more speed and integrity. Oh, not yet available on Switch. Okay, but you're working on it. Okay, thank you for that correction. Alright, so only on Steam. And so I'm playing on PC today. And I do have my Xbox controller plugged in, so I'm playing with the controller as well. Um, okay, I won't buy anything yet. So we keep earning. Let's see if I can make this one. A little dangerous to go up. Oh, uh, too dangerous to go up. Whoopsies. <laughs> um, okay, but now I have enough to get... Let's get even more speed. Okay. Oops. Okay, going for this one. I can make it. Like some more time. Let's see if I can go over one of these a little bit better. All right, here we go. this boost. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is dangerous. Oh! Am I gonna burn? What happened? Where am I? Okay. <laughs> I lived. Oh, I'm gonna run out of speed. No! That was fake lava. <laughs> Okay. Alright, 
Now let me purposely fly over this lava. It's gonna, yeah, it's gonna lift me up. Um, oh gosh, can I get to the time? Nope, oh no, no, no. Okay. Hmm. there. I wonder if people are already competing for longest run. I haven't done the compete section yet. Oh, there's already two people at least competing for speed runs. Oh my gosh. There's an achievement for passing without a single death. I don't know if I'll ever get that one. Wow. Also, one thing that I was wondering earlier is if I do back out of the story mode, does it save and will it start me at the level I'm currently at? Yes, it saves the level you played. <laughs> oh yeah, okay. I can upgrade to the next plane. So let me see where I'm at. A little over an hour, because I am wondering if I should check out the compete mode. <laughs> um, let me put on this plane though first. I really want to check this out. Mom, boy, best boy. That's the plane I just got. And then, um, uh, I'll keep racking up the currency there. I won't do an upgrade. Oh, oh gosh. He's fast. Oh my gosh. to see what it's like to boost this guy. Alright, hold on. Let me aim for some time first. 
Ooh. Ooh. Goodness. Check out what do I have? You know what? Let me increase steering. I do want that to be upped a little bit. That's not even his final form. You can like upgrade these in their form. Oh, and you do have different types of paper, but it's just for appearances, so it's just cosmetic. That's really interesting. Gosh, this just feels like a little rocket plane compared to the other ones I was using. Oh gosh, now we're in ice case with dangerous icicles. Shattering. Ooh. Ah, uh, I missed that time. It's not gonna go well. It's too far away. The time. No! Okay. Always use the cheapest paper round as a kid. You'd go crazy with it. IRL, I'm assuming if you actually started building paper planes again. Let me see. Let's increase lift. Okay, so the other thing that I want to do, because this whole time I've just been playing story mode, um, so I think it'll leave me off at this freeze one. Um, I'm not giving up. I just want to check out some of the other stuff. So I'm going to quit out of story mode. Okay, so there's Zen and there's Compete. Oh my gosh. And I don't think Zen was unlocked at first. I had to play a little bit of the story. Let me let me do a little bit of Compete. Um, uh... I don't know if I'm competitive at all, but, uh, okay, let's see. Fly fast and close to surfaces to gain points, okay. Um, yeah, let's use the new plane and let's begin. Oh gosh. And this is an all new world, too. 
getting like these fall forest vibes. This is this is pretty cool. So is it like is the better I fly? More points again. Let's see if I can stay close to the ground. Okay, I also see, like, if I start to fly too high, I just, like, don't get any points. Ooh. I wonder if I could have fit in between that branch. I wonder if that meter at the top is also my time, perhaps? Uh oh, I'm slowing down. Oh no! Okay, that was my score. What did I get? Eight thousand? Number twenty-five, okay. Oh, it is one of the story levels. I just haven't gotten there yet. Okay. I was like, oh my gosh, I haven't seen this before. Um, okay, so I'm, that one I got, what, 25th out of, oh my gosh, almost 5,000 people have played, have competed. Okay. Yeah, let me try one more time. Um, I do like this plane. This one's fun. Let's... Stick with this plane. Oh, there's a boost. Oh, and I missed it. Cool. gonna go through this branch. Aim for tighter spaces and go in between trees. Okay, good tips. Let me try doing that. Oh, because I guess it does say close to surfaces, not necessarily the ground. I think I want to try this level just a couple more times and then make sure to check out because I want to very thoroughly check out all the different things. See that little point boost I just got there. Yes. I dangerously do this. Oh my gosh.
goodness. I'm like purposely going in between these narrow little spaces. It makes me nervous. It's giving me a lot of points. Gosh. Nope, I'm scared. I chickened out of that one. A little branch. Let's do this. Oh! Oh no! Oh no, I just lost a lot of points for that. Okay. Let's do this. Or not. I'm going down. I'm going down! Ah. Ooh. Okay. Went up in rank. Try that one more time. Last time, I promise. <laughs> Even if I crash and burn right away. Okay, but now I definitely get how going in between the trees and such helps my score tremendously. The music is motivational too, I feel like. Oh, is this the end? Oh, okay. Actually, I made it to the end. Can't stop until at least 20. Well, there you go, I got 20. <laughs> I can make top 10 easily. Oh, thank you. I know, because like, okay, so I just played it a few times, now I'm up to 20. So I feel like if I actually practice the compete mode, maybe I could get up there. <laughs> also, hi, Righteous. <laughs> okay. I know I said last time on this, but I'm ranking up, so should I try it again? Well, you know what? Let me let me look at something. Oh, hollow logs are points galore. Tunnels double the points. Interesting. Okay, the other thing that I want to check out, or that I'm curious of, is if I quit out, will it load a different map in? <sighs> okay, I'm gonna think that over while I. You guys are convincing me to play it one more time. <laughs> Because now I'm starting to understand this compete mode, and this is cool. Oh, this is this week's map. Okay, that's good to know. So this is like the one map for the week. Which could also be a good thing, because then it doesn't, you know, mess you up that you're all of a sudden in a different map that you're not getting used to. Okay. So you have like all week to perfect this one. Oh, man. I might get really competitive on this now, because like, I understand the point system. I'm ranking up. I'm excited. See if I can generally just fly a little bit lower. Nope, oh, is that a log? I'm looking for these other things. Maybe I can do that. Yes. Oh! Oh no, that was a mistake. <laughs> Oops. Oh, you'll post the top 10 players at the end of the week. Man, now I really want to be in top 10. Whoa! Okay. Oop. 
Negative? I didn't know you could have negative points. Is this the thing where you... Oh my gosh. <gasps> That's the log. Okay. I just got... Well, I was negative, so I got, what, 12,000 points for doing that? Up. Oh, that was when I could have gone through. Oh my gosh. Okay, now I'm noticing all the logs as I'm flying past them. Whoops. to discover the best route and to perfect the execution. Yeah, that's what I'm realizing, because it's the same map all week, so you can kind of figure out, okay, I'm going to do this log and then zigzag through these trees and then go into this branch and the best plane for the course. Ah, that's also a good point. Alright. Again, so I plan this to be a two-hour stream. I got 30 minutes left. I'm going to try a couple more times on the stream, and then I still want to check out the Zen mode. But I'm definitely going to be working on this throughout the week now. Like, now I want to see, like, can I make top 10? Oh, you have different leaderboards for different planes. Oh, that's also really interesting. Wouldn't be fair otherwise. That makes sense because they fly really differently. Like, this one feels so much faster than the other ones that I have. Okay, so now the question is... How, if I, throughout the week, work on this with the different planes I have, where can I rank with each plane? That's what I'm curious to know now. If I try to stay to the left, i just, oh. This is not gonna be a good run. <laughs> oh, lost air. Oh wait, now I'm gaining, okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, I gotta remember that one there. Okay, I see a path. It's like one log to go on top of, one to go through, one to go on top of. So I can work on that. Oh no! Whoops. <laughs> Ping us if you complete the game. I want to see your reaction to the ending. Yeah. 
Oh, you're also one of the developers. Yeah. Cool. Thanks for joining the stream as well. I wonder... I can research this too. With what level I'm at, how many more levels I'd have to go in the story. Um, also... Okay. I've been trying this compete thing for a little while. Um, like I said, I'm definitely going to be working on this throughout the week and see how far I can rank up. Um, but I'm going to... Oh, you can see this in the level select. Okay. Um, that's good to know. So I'll keep an eye on that. I'll definitely ping you guys when I get close to that. Um, yeah, and I can stream that as well so I can let you know. Um, but like I said, I got a little bit of time left. I do want to take a break from the compete in this live stream and check out the Zen mode. Um... Oh, also Righteous asks, is there also a leaderboard for your friends or is it just overall? Um, currently not, but we are working to add this in the future updates. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, <laughs> I know Righteous likes to see how he stacks up against his friends as well. I think they do that in Beat Saber, and I can't remember what other games. Um, let me... Let me just see what the Zen mode, though, is. I still don't know this one. And I almost feel like... Um... Maybe I'll do the original, original playing. Oh, wow. Okay, another world that... I... No, I haven't seen this one. I had to think about that for a minute. Oh wait, no, yes I have. <laughs> I'm like noticing things that I didn't notice before. This is that that one level I was super stuck on before, but now I'm in Zen mode. <gasps> Whoa! Okay, so I didn't have to unlock that, it just did it on its own. My boosts. So I'm assuming that it lets you play the maps. But you're not trying to get time, you can't earn currency it looks like, you just fly. So it's like without all the stuff you're trying to achieve, you can just chill and play through it. I'm this. Oh wait, hold on, now I'm reading the chat. Um, my finger is almost ready to buy this game. Yeah, I'm having a ton of fun with this. Like I said, it was $14.99 on Steam. You can support our indie developers here who clearly worked very hard on this game. Looks super cool. Um, I'm also seeing Zen Mode has a configure screen. If you hit escape in the new game, you can configure the experience. Hmm. Oh, I can randomize the generation. Oh, ooh, ooh, wait. Okay, this is the configure menu. Experience can be, let's see, we got relaxing, casual, exhilarating, interesting. Level length, short or long, and the environments can be classic or random. Okay, let me mess around with this. Let me try random. Oh gosh, <laughs> let me try exhilarating. I don't know what that means. That sounds like it could be intense. Um, and then for that, you know what, let's just put on this plane. So, that's good. That's good. Whoa! Okay, I haven't heard this song yet. Very fast. But like... just imagine like the wind in my hair right now. <laughs> I see why this is called exhilarating. Oh my gosh, you even got the little, um... Oh, what are those gardens called? Oh, now we're on the fruit level. I didn't notice those gardens before. Whoa! 
Oh yeah, because that just opens automatically. And also, I really like, even in exhilarating, it's like fast, but it's still really relaxing, and because I'm not trying to get time or anything, I'm just noticing the world more. Like now I'm just, I'm like looking at the starry skies, and, oh, I can do that. <laughs> This is cool if you just like, I just want to chill out and feel like I'm flying in a game and like if you just want to relax, you know, perfect for a Sunday afternoon or evening. Oh wow. And I didn't notice how like the, the water looked before and everything in the water, look at that. Yeah, Zen Mode, I feel like, definitely allows me to just kind of take in the scenery. And you can just kind of enjoy, yeah, the design of the levels more. I'm not even picking up these boosts, I'm just flying. Okay, I also just realized what the randomized thing means. Like, I just played through, or flew through the fruit level, which I've done before, but it doesn't connect to the way story mode does. Like, you don't know what level's coming next. Oh my gosh. And in story mode, this is where I left off at which was this freezing level. <laughs> it's also fun, I can kind of just let this fly for a minute while I check out the chat over here. Go ahead and hit bye, I just did it. Nice. like that earlier level but it's more is it the same it's just like daytime Oh, as you reach new levels in story mode, they also unlock in Zen. Whoops, I crashed. Okay, that leads me to the test I was about to do, which is can you crash in Zen mode? Oh! Okay, it just restarts you, though. Oh my gosh. Going into a desert here? What is this? I'm also noticing, like, in general, the music's really cool, but there's, like, a lot of different songs. Like, I've played games where, like, the music starts to get really repetitive really quickly and you get, like, theme songs stuck in your head, basically. But this is quite the soundtrack. And I feel like, yeah, it's, it's music that, like I said, it's motivating, it's uplifting. I feel like I could also do some yoga to this or, like, meditate. back to this volcano level. So one thing that I also want to check out with Zen, so I got a new game, because there were some other configure modes. Um, I'm also just looking at the chat again. You have something very special for the story ending in terms of music. Ooh, okay. That makes me more excited to complete the story. Um, so that was exhilarating mode. Um, let's do... I kind of like this random, let's see what long, if the level length, if I do that, and then I'll switch it all the way down the relaxing, so see two different ends of the spectrum, and then change the level length. And 
Let's see. I don't know. Let's switch back to the, the middle plane that I had there. Okay. So this is... Okay, I can definitely see a huge difference. Like, that as fast, very chill. Now it's nice. Okay. So this is the other thing. Is there's definitely... Um, Time of day changes as well. Ooh, relaxing mode really lets you enjoy the scenery. Oh my gosh. I feel like exhilarating is good if you just want to feel like you're flying and that's the experience you want. But if you're just like, I just want to look at stuff, I feel like relaxing mode is good for that. The fruit level is starting to make me a little bit hungry, though. I kind of wish I had had my strawberries with me today. I see. <laughs> Looks like someone else in the chat is going to check this game out. Also, that was a great question, by the way. How long? What's the average completion time for the story? Two and a half to three hours. Okay. I have to double check. I think I put in, what, an hour, maybe a little bit less today. So I'm probably a little less than halfway. Okay, like I didn't notice this before. The bananas that are like making the archway over here. I still have five levels until the halfway point. Okay, so I'm definitely less than halfway. All right. That's good. I want lots more of this. This is cool. Houses, fairy houses. More in detail. <laughs> the houses are made of mushrooms. Again, on relax mode, you just can... Oh, look at the little tables and the food. Like, I can just note all the detail. I think this is cool. You can just chill out. But it's also nice because I know of other games, whether it's like a snowboarding game, a racing game, you know, you're just trying to get through to the other end and you're so focused on racing or trying to get whatever the objective is, like, you're just flying pot by all the stuff that was put in the level and you never see it, you never notice it. There's never the opportunity to just kind of do this. And then I can also see um, you know, how long I was on that fruit level. So I definitely noticed the difference, long versus short levels.
that first snow level that I went through. Also, a shout out to the developers here. I've been playing this for a couple hours and it is not buggy at all. <laughs> played far too many games lately where I've found bugs and glitches and weird stuff and this is this is playing like really flawlessly. So, awesome. No, seriously, I didn't notice any bug with the sky turning white. <laughs> yeah, just just pretend that one's on purpose. <laughs> talking about this white sky right now. Yeah, that's not a white sky you see right now. Those are just clouds. It's just a cloudy day on this level. <laughs> mm, that's a good point, Righteous. I'll fix for it already. Yeah, the transition of the music is good. Like, oh my gosh, everything just flows. The levels connect, the music connects, like, whether you're playing Zen mode or any of the modes, it's all just very, I don't know, everything just has a flow to it. If only Flight Simulator could have a Zen mode like this where you can just like do whatever. People will be constantly crashing and trying to remember 10 gazillion buttons. Oops! And then I crash. Um, I missed the jumping. Okay, oh, hang on. What does this do? I'm sure I'll learn more about this one here in the story mode, but. And now I'm slowing down. Alright, before I crash again. <laughs> Um, okay. So new game, we figured out that changes, I can change the plane and configure different features, which is cool. Um, options is just control. Oh! Hold on, I didn't explore this. So you can do a gamepad, a mouse, or a keyboard, and then with each one there's options I can turn on there. Like I said, I just hooked up my Xbox controller, plugged it into my PC, it was super easy. Um, and this feels good. Okay, you can also change the music and sound effects levels. Um, this I was messing around with beforehand, so you can probably see the very top of the window. At uh, the top of my stream here, I have it windowed. 
can change all of this. Even like shadow quality. Interesting. Um, oh, I'm also seeing some more questions in the chat of have the developers done any other games? This is your first game. Well, this is fantastic for a first game. And that's cool you'll be working on more. Yeah, I'm excited because this is good. This is really good. Um, let me, because I'm also coming up on two hours and I feel like I've looked at a lot of stuff here. So let me back out. Um, and let me just double check some things. So I played story, zen, compete. Now I feel super competitive there. <laughs> I'll be practicing that one. Um, see, this just gives me the same options. Oh, that's cool. So at any time you can go to the credits too and you can learn more about the uh, developers behind the scenes here. Um, if it's okay. I won't run through the full credits right now, but I do like that that little option is there. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> Um, let me also just look at something really quickly. Oh, okay. I wanted to make sure I understood this part too. Um, so if I go to story mode, I can hit continue and I can see it's got a little picture of the level I left off on and then, okay. So level select. So today I played, whoops, this was the beginning, literally beginning level one. <laughs> now I get it. So I played through... what, eight levels and I'm on level nine and uh, less than halfway. Oh my gosh. That's a lot of levels, that's pretty cool. Um, but now I also see where I can check out level select and understand my progress. And there's an option to start a new game there as well, so pretty cool. Um, where did you hear about this game? Uh, me, so I actually heard about it uh, as part of E3. Um, 28 levels. Okay, nice. I feel like that's a nice wide selection to have some, some fun with this for a little while. That's, that's a good amount of levels. Um, I heard about this game, uh, via E3, by the way. I think in particular it was the Indie Conference. Um, I do like to check out the Indie Conferences. I will turn this volume down a little bit. Oh, actually, it'll pause if I try to change the volume. Um, I do like to check out indie games from time to time, so when I heard that there was a dedicated part of E3 that was just showcasing indie games, I wanted to check it out. And this one in particular just really caught my eye. I just like games where you can fly, um, especially if you get the feeling of flying down right. I just love that. It's just relaxing, it's fun, so when I saw this, I was like, yeah, I want to... This is a game I want to check out for sure, and uh, I had a lot of fun today. Um, so yeah, also really exciting that uh, two developers joined the stream, so thank you so much for chiming in and answering people's questions, and uh, this was really cool. Um, but yeah, as I'm coming up on about two hours, yeah, um, and I checked out all the features, I will conclude the live stream, and yeah, for sure I will check my progress, and when I get toward the end of the story mode, I will live stream that, and I will ping you guys for sure. Will this be Fridays? Yeah, because I typically stream on Fridays and Sundays. That's such a good question. Um, yeah, I was, I was debating, do I do it Friday or do I save it for next Sunday? It's so like a week from now, I stream exactly this. Um, I think I will stream this Friday. So Friday at 7 p.m. Central Time. Um, that's my other normal live stream time to just stream new games, betas, whatever I'm playing at the moment. So yeah, this will probably be Fridays. Good question. Um, yeah, thank you. And what I might also do, I don't know, I'll debate <laughs> whether I just try to save, maybe I'll just do compete all week and then save the story for Friday. Yeah, Friday the 13th. Ooh. <laughs> I don't think that's unlucky though. If anything, maybe it's lucky. Yeah, Friday the 13th, 7 p.m. Central Time, I will be back here, um, probably showing off where I got progress-wise on Compete and playing the story, maybe where I left off. 
I have time to get on and compete and try to be higher than you. Really? That sounds like a challenge. Alright. <laughs> Let's see where we all are on the leaderboards by the end of the week. <laughs> But anyways, um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this live stream. This was so much fun to play today and so much fun to chat with all of you. And uh, thank you so much for joining. And I'll see you. I'll see you Friday. Bring your strawberry. You know what? I will do that too. I will have a bowl of strawberries next time. <laughs> but anyways, I'll see you later. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. <laughs>